Hey, hello everybody, welcome back to Resident Evil 2. Come on, Sherry. Yeah, so remember you have to walk uh, kind of slow when you have Sherry with you. Oh shit! Behind us, Sherry, hold on. Oh, yeah, that spark shot you guys, but we're full. We're gonna have to come come back for the spark shot. left on it. We're at... <laughs> Madness. No bad boys? so nice having 10 item slots, you know? Carries so much. But it's because Claire gets a lot of, uh, uh what's it called? Goddamn Sherry. Because <clears throat> Claire gets a lot of two-handed weapons. Where the hell is she? What are you doing? Oh, <laughs> we can do a little skateboarder. <laughs> Good old Sherry. Sherry, wait here. I'm going to check it out by myself. Okay, I'll wait here, but hurry back. Oh, there's acid there as well. our big boy away, put the valve handle away, back up. We almost have 200 bullets for our pistol. Whew. That's what I'm talking about. Two pieces of health. Totally forgot. Totally forgot we gotta grab the other stuff that's in this room. <laughs> I'm a little overzealous. Yeah. 
we have to go back and uh, get the spark shot. Which is like one of the most devastating weapons in all of Resident Evil. I love the noise that it makes when you shoot it. It sounds like it would hurt so bad. <clears throat> like it really does. It sounds like it would really fucking hurt to get shot with this thing. Yeah, so this is the spark shot. It basically shoots a lightning bolt at the enemy. It's like a giant taser. That's basically what it's what it is. Like, look at it. It's like a wall socket thing, you know what I mean? But it's like designed as a gun. It's kinda like a really, really powerful shotgun. That's that's kinda the way that it works. It's devastating as well. <laughs> Wait until you guys see what it uh, actually looks like. And the noise that it makes as well. I, I, I absolutely adore the noise that it makes. Like I said, it, it really sounds like it would, it would hurt a lot. Or it would just kill you, you know what I mean? I wouldn't be surprised if it just killed you, because it is pretty serious. Let's grab these ink ribbons. Off. Do we have any extra bolts? Where's all our bolts? Okay, they're there. Hell yeah. That uh, spark shot's friggin' huge, too. Kinda works like a shotgun. Alright, we're ready. Wait here, Sherry. <laughs> Some of the most hidden handgun bullets in the entire game right there. my new shit. <laughs> you don't like my new gun very much, do you? It only has about 50 shots or so. It's like 2% per shot or something like that. Or 3%. Can't remember if it's 2 or 3. In either case, it would have... Uh, anywhere from 33 shots to 50. Bum, bum, bum. Sherry. It's okay, kid.
Yep, yeah, yeah, freaking Claire, man. She has that goddamn arsenal of weaponry to use. You can kinda go buck wild. Are you serious? Hurry up, kid. Better not sit down. Right, the key should already be in it. Jump. Yeah. Yeah, because Leon used it. Leon used it before we did. Remember you guys, Leon's the one that actually uh, finds the key, powers it up, and then he fights the tyrant on that platform. Well, he fights William Birkin, level 2. Everybody calls William Birkin the tyrant, but he's not necessarily a tyrant. The tyrant is made using the T, -T virus. Birkin is infected with the G virus. What was that? His name is actually just G. Just wait here. I'll go and see what it was. Like, I'm not even kidding you. If you, uh, if you go into, like, the games, uh, you go, like, you know, Resident Evil lore or something like that, his name is literally just G or G. Birkin. Well, it's G. Birkin until he transforms to the point where it's, you know, not even freaking human anymore. with us. Resident Evil, Resident Evil 2, you guys are... My God. He's so strong, you guys. <laughs> you have once again stepped into the world of survival horror. Good luck. Do -do 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 -do. Uh, speed run. Ow. 
Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, we just have to do that little, uh, <coughs> little, uh, key turning on the thing again. It really helps uh, to like know when to save your game in Resident Evil. Like it really does. Look at how quickly you can die. You know what I mean? That's a good example, actually, of how quickly things go south. <laughs> um... He punched me there. <laughs> I hate it when you're like just a foot away from the thing that you try to use something on. <laughs> Such a pain in the ass. Okay, Sherry, let's go. Yeah, come on, kid. This time I'm gonna win that fight because <laughs> we have health. We brought brought some healing items with us. I always love that noise, that emergency noise. Resident Evil had some really cool sound effects, man. Claire? What was that? Now you better stay here. It's something that you don't want to see, trust me. <laughs> don't worry. Just wait here. I'll go and see what it was. Alright guys, let's whoop his ass. Gotta keep my distance. The only, that's the only problem with the spark shot is that you have to be kind of close to use it. I'm gonna give him two and then we're gonna run. I am already pulling, pulling the trigger over and over again. If you guys are wondering, I'm like literally shooting right now. <laughs> He's jumping, he's jumping, he's jumping. Oh my. One for you. Ah. Can't see. Oh. Yeah. Oh, he's pissed. Oh, he jumped. He's jumping. Oh my. <coughs> ah. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, Claire! Claire Bear! Get up, Claire! Claire, get up! Oh my god, he's about to totally terrorize me as well. I might be able to get a shot off with this. Before he punches me. Or should I run? Should I run or shoot? I think I should run. Because he's on his backswing right now. Oh! <laughs> Just missed! Run, Claire! Get up, get up, get up! Get up, holy crap! I know you're a tough guy, please get up, Claire. Uh, uh, we're almost dead. Claire! Shit! Dodge that. Oh no, fuck you. Where you at? Oh, he's jumping, he's jumping. Man be jumping. The man be jumping. Oh, I can wait. Hey, ah! Bad boy. Oh no. He's jumping. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, the hole right through his legs. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Oh, yeah. See you later. Sherry. Oh, 
I freaking love that fight. That's so good. It's like a goddamn tree frog. <laughs> tree frog with uh, like freaking two foot claws. Isn't this? That's okay. You keep it. I'm sure it'll keep you safe. She gave her. Hear from you, okay? She gave her her Going jacket. Back to look for your mom. Or her uh, vest. Thanks, Claire. Even though I'm an only child, neither of my parents ever spent much time with me because of their work. But now that you're with me, I finally have someone to rely upon. Sherry. It's all right, kid. We're gonna get out of this. Just make sure there's nothing up here. Sherry. <laughs> Damn it. Right, we got a door. And we got a big boy door. Big boy door leads into the big boy room. Gonna need my box. Gonna need to bring my box with me. Pushing a box, pushing a box. Every day, all day, I'll be pushing a box. Pretty sure this room up here is locked right now. Just let me check to make sure. Yes, indeed. What is this again? Power room. The investigative report on the P Epsilon gas. Yes, yes. Hello there. Hmm. 
Ah, uh, you are one of the Model 2s, huh? And you have a friend with you, don't you? Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, eat a dick. Where's your friend at? Eat many dicks, my friend. An iron smelting pool for employees only. What? Clicking, clicking, lots of clicking. So if you're wondering, the uh, box that we pushed into position there, it uh, stays there, now that it's there. The master key is required to open the emergency route, you guys. <laughs> Going down. That's a brutal weapon, eh, you guys? Holy crap, I love the noise that it makes. More flame rounds. Count me in. Let's make sure we're at Maximoto. Well, I guess we'll end it right here there. We're almost at a half an hour, so. Yeah, but thank you guys for coming out and watching this episode of Resident Evil 2. Do me a favor, you guys, leave a like on the video, maybe even subscribe to the channel. Other than that, I freaking love you, and I wish you the total best. I hope you guys have a freaking awesome rest of your day, and of course, I'll see you guys in the very next episode, so be sure to have a good one. Bye-bye.